Hey, what's up guys? My name is Rahul and today I will teach you how to create a fade in and fade out animation in Adobe Photoshop. So let's get started. First create a new document with your favorite size because size doesn't matter on this district. So I have created a new document. Then go to window timeline to enable that timeline panel to create frames for animation. So now we have that document background layer and a, a one frame that one frame so now i'm going to create a text fade and fade animation because you can also use this technique to images as well so now i'm going to type text as an example then as you can see the text layer is enabled on the first frame so I don't want that because I need to create a fade in effect so I hide that then click new then and hide it so on the first frame there is no text layer the second layer there is text layer but now this don't look like a fade in we need to create a smooth fade in like a on first frame the opacity is zero on the last frame the opacity is 100 percentage so there is a icon here that is motion tune click on that then click ok leave the settings to default you don't need to mess around that that is just need to make sure that tune with previous frame frames you add five parameters all selector layers are layers then click ok then let's play it spacebar to play it or you can press on that play icon down here so as you can hear this fade in and fade out you can change the time of a frame by selecting the whole clip then click here then select a different type as you can hear as you can see there it's fade in and we need to create fade out so create a new frame then on that frame we don't need this text layer because we need to create a fade out effect so hide that text layer then again click on the motion tool then click OK by selecting that last frame because you need to make sure that you have selected the last frame then play a guy this is a bit slow just change the time a little bit to one second maybe looks great yep as you can see fade in and fade out you can also use the technique to images as well so that's all guys, hope you guys can enjoy and I think this video is really helpful. So if you think it is helpful and if you enjoyed it, then please give a big thumbs up, comment, share, that will help me a lot. You guys know about it. Then support me by pressing on that subscribe icon and thanks all guys, goodbye.